Genesis 13.8 Abraham rescues Lot Genesis 14 Four kings go against the king of Sodom. The four kings seized all the goods of Sodom and Gomorrah and all their food. Then they went away. They also carried off Abraham's nephew Lot. He was living in Sodom and his possessions since he was living in Sodom. One who had escaped came, reported this to Abraham, and Abraham found out that his relative Lot had been taken captive. He called out 318 trained men born in his household and went in pursuit. They found them and they divide, they went and they attacked and they recovered all the goods and brought back his relative Lot and his possessions together with the women and the other people. After Abram returned, he, the king of Sodom came out to meet him in the valley of Sheva, that is the valleys, the king's valley. Then Melchizedek, king of Salem, brought out bread and wine. He was priest of God Most High, and he blessed Abram, saying, Blessed be Abram by God Most High, creator of heaven and earth. And blessed be God Most High, who delivered your enemies into your hand. Abram gave him a tenth of everything. The king of Sodom said to Abram, Give me the people and keep the goods for yourself. But Abram said to the king of Sodom, I have raised my hand to the Lord, God Most High, creator of heaven heaven and earth and have taken an oath that I will accept nothing belonging to you not even a thread or the thong of a sandal so that you will never be able to say I made Abram rich I will accept nothing but what my men have eaten and the share that belongs to the men who went with me Later on, Lot went back to Sodom and had um, two daughters, Genesis eighteen twelve says, or 19 and 19, God told Abraham that he's going to destroy Sodom and Gomorrah. Abraham pleads, but God sends two angels to destroy Sodom and Gomorrah. They rescue Lot and two daughters. His wife turned back, though, and um, she turned into some salt, a pillar of salt. So Lot and both his daughters went up to a mountain. Both the daughters got him drunk one night because they wanted children, and they... Um, had children from him because there was nobody else to have children by. Melchizedek, king of Salem, that was ancient Jerusalem at the time, was both king and priest and was revered by Abraham, who paid a tenth to him. Genesis 19.30, Lot's older daughter, had a son, and she named him Moab. He is the father of the Moabites. Ruth 4.13, Ruth, a Moabite woman who commits herself to the Israelite people, later marries her second husband, Boaz. Then she gave birth to Obed, a son, becoming the great-grandmother of King David. She is in 
the family line genealogy of Yeshua Christ.